this is Mike, Family DIY TV on the YouTube. And today we're gonna show you how to clean your salt cell generator for your pool. Simple, simple, simple. Let's do this and stay tuned. Okay, so your salt cell needs to be clean. How do you know? Um, either your salt cell generator will stop creating as much chlorine as it used to, or there'll be an indicator, or it'll just be three months or whatever the manufacturer says, and it's time to clean. So to clean this salt cell, you need to use acid. So it's very highly recommended that you wear safety glasses and gloves. Okay, with the safety equipment out of the way, now we need to remove the actual salt cell generator from the plumbing. Before we do that, we need to turn off the power. Then we're gonna remove the salt cell generator from the plumbing using the unions that are in the plumbing. You can see me unscrewing it here. And then we're gonna put our salt cell generator to the side very carefully. Okay, so now we want to actually mix our cleaning solution. And our cleaning solution is gonna be muric acid and it's gonna be four parts water to one part muric acid. So in this case, we're gonna do four quarts of water to one quart of muric acid. And mix that up in a bucket. Move on to putting the cap on one end of the salt cell and then we're gonna stand the salt cell up on the cap. So now what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna pour that clean solution into the salt cell and we're gonna cover the fins. And what you expect to see is some kind of foaming action. And what that foaming action is doing is actually cleaning the salt cell. It should go for about five, 10 minutes. In my case, my salt cell actually wasn't that dirty. It would, took about a minute and stopped foaming and I was done. If yours takes longer, you may have to repeat this process two or three times until it stops foaming. Once it's done, you'll be able to tell because the fins will look clean. Okay, and at this point, you're done cleaning the salt cell. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna run clean water through the salt cell, get rid of all that acid, and then you're gonna wanna carefully dispose of the acid that you mixed. You don't wanna get that on anything, it will burn, okay? And at this point in the video, I'm gonna ask you a favor. Please hit that like button. Please consider subscribing to this channel and please leave me a comment below, okay? But now what you're gonna do is you're just going to reverse the order of putting it together. So you're gonna put the salt cell back into the plumbing. You're gonna tighten it up, hand tight, no tools here. And then you're gonna reconnect the power and turn the power on and enjoy your pool. You did a great job, thank you. I appreciate you watching and this is Mike from Family DIY and I am 